When it comes to understanding or debugging wireless networking behavior, nothing beats a captured trace of wireless network activity. And just like a tracing program in a debugger, the more information you can get to debug the program, the better your chances of solving it. That's why Simplicity Studio includes a network analyzer feature that allows live or previously captured network traffic to be examined in detail. Simplicity Studio's network analyzer incorporates all the features of Silicon Labs Ember desktop software, which has been a leading network analysis and debugging tool among Zigbee application developers for over 10 years. More than simply a packet sniffer, Simplicity's network analyzer works with Silicon Labs' patented Packet Trace Interface, or PTI, peripheral on its wireless chips to provide direct feedback from the baseband radio of each device allowing any supported Silicon Labs radio to report detailed packet transmission and reception data, such as timestamps, link quality, or LQI, received sensitivity, or RSSI, and CRC pass-fail results, all without any software overhead. Simplicity Studio even allows you to capture from multiple sources simultaneously into the same log file without falsely duplicating packets, so you can compare how well different radios in your network heard the same transmission. Of course, being able to view every byte of every packet is great when you want maximum detail, but what about when you have to sift through thousands of packets to try to find if and where something has gone wrong? Suppose you're not a protocol expert. How do you know if your packets were exchanged successfully and whether you've got the right responses? With Simplicity Studio's Network Analyzer, we make it easier to understand the workings of a complex wireless protocol. Related network packet events are automatically grouped into a transactions pane within the capture window allowing for a quicker parsing of what's happening during that portion of the traffic log. Quickly access statistics like total duration, number of related packets, number of point-to-point -point and end-to-end -end retries, and unexpected conditions like requests with missing responses or deliveries where expected acknowledgments are missing. You can even scroll through the events in that transaction while skipping over unrelated events that occurred during that time frame. And when those long-running captures collect thousands of packets, You'll be glad to know that our network analyzer offers a sophisticated set of filters that can be applied to any part of a transaction or event just to find the data that's of interest to you. Filters can be applied to live or pre-captured traffic and can be entered via the expression filter by selecting one of the suggested filters in the context menu of the transactions or events pane, or by manually entering or editing text in the filter bar. Filters can be chained together using regular expressions to produce more specific results. Filters can also double as search criteria when you want to see the rest of the surrounding events for context. When you find something interesting or concerning in your log files, you can even bookmark them for future reference. This is great for annotating your captures during debugging or collaborating with other users. But Simplicity Studio's Network Analyzer does more than just examine packets. It can also record software-based debug activity from the firmware on your embedded networking devices, allowing application developers a glimpse into which firmware events correlate closely in time with certain network-related events and transactions, which can be a big help in shedding light on why a certain network activity occurred or why it had a particular outcome. Silicon Labs even provides a virtual UART interface to allow for traditional printf output through serial wire debug lines, so you can see your application's printfs among stack API and callback activity. Other critical software activities such as resets, assert violations, and stack startups are also captured in this events listing, so developers have the maximum amount of information about what happened at runtime. This recorded information can also be a big help to Silicon Labs' experienced application engineers when customers have questions about behavior in the stack or application.